All right, hello everybody, because it is I, Granite, and here we are, back with another episode, our final episode of this Ice-type playthrough, Pokemon Gen 2, as we are going to head into Mount Silver and take on Red, and hopefully be victorious, and this team is pretty, you know, good, at least, you know, three-fourths of it, so we shouldn't have an issue taking down Red, except for, of course, his Snorlax as we always seem to have an issue taking down so let's get up there first and then we'll look at stats before we go into the final battle So our team is as such going into this. Jinx, level 65, 202 hit points. Uh, Never Melt Ice, Psychic Sing, Nightmare Ice Punch, Rocking, uh, pretty high special attack and uh, special defense and speed, low attack and defense, which is to be expected. Dugong, level 65, pretty even stats across the board, except for special defense is pretty high. Leftovers, Ice Beam, Wrestling Talk, Surf. And 100 or 231 hit points. Delibird, Bird, 162 hit points. Rocking the King's Rock, Fly, Thief, Attract, and Blizzard. Uh, pretty low stats across the board. And then Cloyster, high, high defense. And then decent attack and special attack. Mystic Water, Surf, Spikes, Rain Dance, Blizzard. And 177 hit points. We're going to start off with. Jinx up front as we go in to take on Red. So here we go. First we've got to get past the Pikachu, of course. Let's see how much we do with a Psychic. One hit, excellent. That's what I wanted to see. What do we have coming out next? Charizard coming out next, excellent. We are going to swap to... See, Cloyster's got pretty low special defense, but this would allow us to set up our other stuff that we want to get down. So let's throw the spikes down. How much would we take from this? Now that is a lot. Right now we're going to switch to Dugong. Yeah, and Dugong takes that on the chin and then recovers, so that's not even a problem. We're going to use a Hyper Potion here on Cloyster. Take another Flamethrower and then Rest. Oh, he's faster than us. Well, that's the problem, isn't it? Um, let's throw out Cloyster. Let's drop a Rain Dance. And then we're going to max revive Dugong. Take a Flamethrower. Uh, now we're going to swap back to Dugong. Oh, can't be recalled because we're in a fire spin. Well, I guess we're going to go down then. So let's... Go ahead and max revive Cloyster. Take the wing attack. Now we're going to serve. The rain is still going, so that's good. Alright, what do we have next coming out? Next is the Espeon, which is an interesting choice. 
Um, I mean, we still have the rain up, I believe. No, the rain stops there, or I should have switched. Oh, we'll be fine. Well, that hurt quite a bit. Quite a bit more than I expected it to. I think it's gonna just barely hang on. Let's heal up Dugong. He'll probably heal up. No, he doesn't heal up here. Good deal. Alright, next is the Storlax, and this is what we were worried about. We're gonna switch to Cloyster here. Trying to have some big blizzards. That didn't do like anything, and now he's just. We need to freeze it. Would be nice if we froze it. Ah, and we're paralyzed. Very nice. Just take a couple of those while we heal up. Okay. So we'll set up a rain dance. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna speed through this part because this is gonna take forever. Paralyzed again. Oh my goodness. One and three chance my butt. That was a good critical hit. Too bad that was our final snore. Or our final, um. Blizzard. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Man, I'm running out of attacks here with Cloyster. I could.
And look, Lurch, you like no damage to it. Until we get to the point where Storlax is just gonna run out of attacks. Less of amnesias. So, why don't we switch to Delibird then? Since he's rose his special defense, he doesn't have high defense. Okay. That's done. Hui. So for Venusaur, we want to set out Jeans. Now the sunny day, funnily enough, is actually going to hurt Blastoise a lot more than it's going to hurt me. Good job, Jinx. up right away. Puts down the rain. Sleep again? Nope. Not that lucky. Now this is gonna hurt. But we have good special defense on Jinx, but he did put up the rain right before he did it. I probably could just like psychic it down, honestly. But I want to get the nightmare up. Critical hit. Good deal. That's it. All right. So let's uh, see what our next team's gonna be. Go ahead and cut that out. We'll go to my desktop and we'll pop open my dice roller here. Boom. All right, so of course, first things first, with our playthroughs, we have to see what starter we're going to have. So we're just going to roll one through three. Um, one is going to be Chikorita, two Cyndaquil, three Totodile. Boom! So we're going to be starting out with a Chikorita. And now for the fun part, we're going to see what type we're going to use. We have 15 types left, and the order, of course, is Grass, Poison, Fire, Flying, Water. Bug, normal, ground, electric, fighting, rock, psychic, ice, dragon, steel. We have finished ghost and uh, dark, so go. Number eight, grass, poison, fire, flying, water, bug, normal, ground. Ooh, our first ground type team. There are... Nine, what, 13? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 ground types. 
uh, in Gen 2, which means we're going to have one team of four and three teams of three. So this will be our team of four that we'll use first. Uh, and the order that they go, uh, of course, this is alphabetically by someone in the evolution line, is Cubo, Marowak, Diglett, Doug Trio, Banfi, Donpan, Geodude, Dizrolum, Gligar, Larvitar, Pupitar, stopping at Pupitar, of course, um, Nidto Rand and Nidto King, Nidto Rand and Nidto Queen, Onyx Felix, Swine of Pyloswine, Wooper, Quagsire, Rhyhorn, Rhydon, and Sandshrew, Sandslash. So our team is going to be number 13, Sandshrew, Sandslash. Number 3, Fan Fee, Don Fan. Number 2, Diglett, Doug Trio. And number 5, Gligar. So our team is going to be Doug Trio, Don Fan, Gliger, and Sandslash when we're finished. Which is going to have a hard time with water types. 